Welcome, 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 everyone. We are live streaming from ITW 2024. This is JSA TV and JSA Podcast, your newsroom for digital infrastructure. I am Jamie Scott Okataya, CEO of JSA. And joining me here today, I am so excited to be speaking with Jeff Geyser. He is the Vice President of Customer Engagement with Zenlayer. Jeff, welcome, me. welcome. Yeah, thank you for having me today. Uh, we are so thrilled, so excited. And by the way, Zenlayer killing it. I love hearing that. That's you guys, great. of course, known for your connectivity and its amazing impact in emerging markets. So let's start there. What uh, regions are presenting the most opportunities for you? Yeah, we're deployed worldwide. So we've got a big deployment in the US and Europe, but you're right, where we really focus our energy is in the emerging markets. And you know, we, we have companies talking to us about Middle East and India and South America and Africa. But I think what really, I don't think there's any conversation that happens without talking about Asia. Yeah. It probably holds the most promise. And when you look at Asia as an opportunity for global companies, it's got amazing growth. So I think 60% of GDP growth this year is yeah. coming from Asia. And most companies, if they haven't, you know, if they're not already in Asia, they're certainly looking to deploy there and expand the footprint. So Asia is probably where we have the most conversations and holds the most promise. Yeah, I know. And, and you guys are, again, everywhere in Asia, I feel like. Yeah. <laughs> Totally getting that market. Okay, so what are some of the challenges that go along with all this expansion? Yeah, I think most companies have, have probably taken a look at Asia. And there are a couple of approaches they've taken. One is they might have already deployed in some central locations in Asia, and they're challenged with just the end user experience. Right. So latency challenges, or maybe they're even serving it from other regions. And so they, they really want to improve the user experience across that region. But then when you look to go deploy in Asia, it's a highly fragmented market. You've got to work with a lot of different vendors, a lot of different network providers. So it's a very complex environment to manage on your own. And then every single country is different in terms of regulatory requirements, compliance requirements. So it extends your time to market. It's complex to undertake as an organization. So partnerships in the region are really, really critical. Very critical. So what makes Zenlayer a great partner, especially for enterprises looking to expand into these uh, in Asia? Yeah, so we look to just make it as easy as possible and provide very fast, flexible service. So we've deployed in 300 POPs worldwide. Wow. And in each one of our POPs, we'll deploy a compute stack of some variety. We'll deploy virtual machines, bare metal, uh, maybe customized bare metal. So if you have some really unique requirements in region that you need to have deployed, we can do that in those POPs. Most of that's available on our console, so you can just point and click and deploy very quickly, but um, we've got a lot of that. flexibility in terms of compute. And then we interconnect all of those pops with networks. So we run our own private backbone. We've got 130 terabit per second backbone. Wow. Private backbone that you can leverage for regional capacity, regional connectivity, or connectivity worldwide. And then we also provide our own IPT BGP blend. So low latency access to local networks, eyeball networks. And so our goal in those markets, anytime we provide our BGP blend, is really like low latency, sub 25 millisecond connectivity to all end users in that particular city and or country. And then of course we provide um, kind of east-west connectivity, if you will, connectivity to cloud providers, major hyperscalers, probably other partners that you might already be deployed with so that we can connect those public or private compute stacks to the compute stacks we're helping you deploy. Wow. You see, yeah, you just touched on so many pain points that I know a lot of friends in our industry are, are experiencing and you yeah. guys uh, are clearly a great partner for them to, to research. Um, but before I let you go, yeah, I want to know any big news or news that you might have here at ITW? Yeah. So to dovetail, you know, obviously the goal is to make it very, very easy to deploy in these markets. So one of the things we're really excited about is we've expanded our ability to uh, deploy a single port multi-access port, single port in a region gives you access to all of our services on the network. So you can deploy a single port on our console, get access to our backbone, our IPT, all of our cloud services, remote office connectivity. And then we've also expanded our availability of 100 gig ports. Um, and then I guess lastly, we're talking about Asia. So we spent a lot of time improving our fabric in Asia. So we're connecting major, uh, in major cities, connecting all of our pops with a very uh, low latency, high bandwidth, metro connectivity to improve connectivity in major hubs in each of the Asia markets as well. Well, I am so glad you guys are on the job here because our industry needs good connectivity, high bandwidth, 
I mean, you guys are the answers to our tomorrow's problems and challenges. So we adore you. Thank you we'll, so much. We'll try to live up to the challenge. <laughs> you're, you're doing it. You're doing it. All right, guys. That There you have it. Jeff Geyser, VP of Customer Engagement with Zenlayer. Thank you. Thank you very much. And thank you, viewers, for tuning in to JSA TV. Happy networking.